So it's noon on the 11th. I'm here on Wainimi Road looking towards the Santa Monica Mountains, looking towards the campus of CSUCI and uh, Boney Mountain, etc. Point Magoo is right, is right there. Um, so good perspective here. Um, uh, the winds are really picking up. Uh, they began peaking at about 10 o'clock. The Santa Ana winds are estimating uh, perhaps as high as 50 mile an hour gusts, but potentially even higher um, uh, for the next couple days, but in particular today between 10 o'clock and four. So we're kind of in the, the, the heat of it right now. So we're seeing uh, the fire has moved back up the backside, the ocean side of the Santa Monica Mountains. And it's, uh, and the fire line is getting close to the top, the crest of Boney Mountain again. Um, uh, so now, uh, so we're right near the Camrio Airport, uh, one of the areas where air resources are staging out of. Um, and uh, so, so a lot of air activity before, it's beginning to die down a bit. So the, the turbulence is getting to be a bit at the uh, less than 10,000 uh, foot level. And so um, really, really difficult to get into the canyons and dump. But then also when they dump the material that they're going to dump, either water or phos check, whatever it is, um, gets sprayed over a, a large area and isn't as effective. So um, the wind is kind of running the show right now. So both the fire driven weather, but then also the Santa Ana, Santa Ana um, wind conditions, which are going from inland out to sea uh, out that way uh, here on the fourth day of the uh, Hill and Woolsey fires in Southern California along the Ventura, Los Angeles county line.